everyone. So before we start, I want you to watch this video for us to know what is our new topic for today. Okay, so let's watch this video. So this is a story of four people. Everyone, look at here. So we have everybody was sure of somebody. This one is somebody. That was too slow. Uh, it's okay. So, since we can't play the video, so let's start our lesson for today. So, our lesson is about indefinite pronouns. Okay? So, our lesson is about indefinite pronouns. Again, everybody, let's say indefinite pronoun Okay, so our lesson is about indefinite pronoun. So we have a uh, different kinds of indefinite pronouns, okay? But for today, we're going to talk all about only somebody Nobody and anybody. Okay, so now what is somebody? Uh, power. This one. Yes. Okay, so now look at our TV. So what what is somebody? So 
Some body means a part. Sorry, some body is a part. Or it is refers to a person without saying who it is or who she is, who he is. Okay. Somebody, you put to bang phone, kai ko dai. Pen chai ko dai, or pen hu yi ko dai. It is like a part of a group. It is like a part of a group. So here are some examples of. Somebody. So we can use somebody in a sentence. For example, somebody top two hundred dollar bills to my account. So we use somebody here because we don't know who top or who put one hundred. Okay. So. Now here, somebody top one hundred dollar bills to my account. So you're going or you're going to use somebody. Teacher, I don't know. It's okay, teacher. My auto lang ngayon yung tumo na. Hindi ngayon yung tamang auto lang niya. I don't know, teacher. I already removed it, and I don't know why it. It's okay, teacher. So here. Somebody. So, stop recording first. Okay, a part of a pool. Okay. Okay, now, a part of a pool. Thank you, picture. So now, it also refers to a person without saying who. Okay, it refers to a person without saying who she is or who he is. Okay, now here are some examples of somebody. When you use it in a sentence, so now we have somebody top, it means somebody put two $100 bills in my account or to my account. So I didn't know who put a $200 bills. So you're going to use somebody. Okay, did you understand? Somebody, we use with anyone. We don't know who it is. 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 Somebody, but some people. Nati, are you sleepy? Okay, if you please sit uh, properly. Next, we have somebody will be out here trying to harvest. So here, we use again somebody and then we didn't know who will harvest the plants, right? Or the vegetables. So somebody will come here to harvest some fruits, vegetables, or anything. So we use somebody. Because you didn't know who will harvest it, okay? So next, I may have to tell you somebody about something. So you're going to, this one, I may have to tell somebody, but I don't know what, who is the person is, about something. About something, it means you didn't know, uh, you're going to talk about something, okay? We don't have any particular to talk about, so we use something. Okay, we don't have any specific topic, so we're going to use something. And this one, we don't have any specific person, so I use somebody. Okay, did you understand? Okay, can you give me an, uh, an example of somebody? We use it in a sentence. เราใช้คำว่า somebody แต่งประโยคให้พี่เชื่อสักเพื่อหนึ่งประโยคสิคะมีใครอยาก Can you um think of an example where where you going to use somebody โดยการใช้คำว่า somebody มีไหมแต่งประโยคอะไรก็ได้ค่ะโดยใช้คำว่า somebody somebody แปลว่าบางคนนะคะใช้เป็นผู้ชายหรือผู้หญิงก็ได้ค่ะอ่านลองลองซิ Okay somebody what somebody Okay, for example, I'm, call, I'm calling someone, right? Somebody who wants to answer. Or, because I don't know who will I call or who wants to answer, right? So I use somebody. Okay, so.
So now, let's continue since you don't want to answer. So now, let's continue with nobody. So nobody, it means none. ไม่มีใครเลย nobody. Okay, so nobody, it also means does not refers to any particular person. It means none, nothing. Okay, no one. So we use nobody also for a person. Okay, nobody, no person, nothing, none. Okay, do you understand about nobody? Do you understand? Grade five. เข้าใจไหมคะ Nobody, แต่ว่าอ okay, so I'm am I talking to the air? Oh, can you please answer, teacher? Are you do you understand? Yeah. Okay, so now let's have another example. Please read louder, please. So here. Nobody could answer this question. It means no one could answer this question because I don't know if it is hard or no one likes to talk. Okay, so no one, so nobody could answer this question. Next, everyone, no, I'll, I'll wait. Everyone. Great 
five. Ah, uh, please sit properly. You look like you're uh, at home. Everybody should have time to share. There. Okay. So all of us wants to share, or all of us should share our dreams with somebody. Okay. Or someone. Next is here. You can open your book. Open ang suka. Uh, your student book, and then we're going to answer your activity. So number one. Okay. So number one, it is on page. 70. Student book or workbook? This one is the student's book. Ah, but the student book is the student book. The student book is the student book. Okay, so now let's answer it all together. So number one, you're going to choose from this words we have somebody nobody everybody and anybody so uh, anybody means refers to um, unlimited set of people so anyone anyone or anybody okay okay so next number one Black bought the stickers at the store, but I know who did it. So what will be the answer here? I already put the answer. So what is it? I. I let's say I'm okay. Somebody bought the sticker at the store, but I know who did it. So someone or a part um, refers to somebody bought the stickers at the store. But, I know who did it. Okay, so what would be the answer? It is? Some? Okay, so now, you write your answer on your book. Can you write your answer on your book? You can write your answer on your book. Okay, are you finished? Nurse, book. Finish? Okay, next. Number two. I didn't hear anything. So I didn't hear anything. Blank knock on the door. What will be the answer here? Stop the Nika for song. Huh? Okay, so somebody. Somebody knock on the door. Next, number three. For Sam. The shop. Okay, the shop clerk helped Black. But she doesn't know who it was. So here, we use was here. So we're going to use what pronouns? Is it somebody, nobody, everybody, or anybody? If, uh, if the clue here, but she doesn't know who it was. So we use was here. So it, is, it means a part or someone. If we use here, but she doesn't know who it were, it means we're going to use everybody. Since we use was, was, was is a singular, right? So was, or the past tense of is, so we will use somebody. Okay, are you finished? The animation teacher, I already put the answer. 
Okay, finish. So number four, everyone. Uh, please read the question. Everybody has a very good. So everybody has a neck. So all of us has a neck. Who doesn't have neck? So no one, right? So everybody, <laughs> everybody has a neck. Okay. So we will use what? We will use. Everybody, very good. Next, number five. Blank can do that. It was very hard. So it means something is hard. So, so we will use. Nobody, nobody can do that. It means it is very hard for someone to do it. Okay. So did you understand the use of somebody, everybody, nobody, and anybody? No. Huh? Okay. Did you understand? Yes. Okay. So now let's have some activity from uh, let's have some worksheet for you to answer. Okay, so I have here a worksheet and then you're going to fill in somebody, anybody, nobody or everybody. Okay? So if you have any question you can all uh, Raise your hand and I will go to you. So please write your name on the top of the paper. So how about the accent sticker? I think they can do this at home, right? Uh -huh. One paper. How many pictures? Five or and online. Online picture, right? You can send the Okay, five. And then this one is for group A tomorrow. One teacher team name is five. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> I thought five is a I think teacher we can also end the line since it's already done. Do I need to say goodbye people? Okay, so for uh, for online I will send you a document about your worksheet and you can answer your worksheet on on your at your house, okay? So that's all for today. Thank you for watching. Bye everyone.